Largest living bird. Ostrich. O S T R I C H. Oh, hello there, viewer. I didn't even see you there. <laughs> I was just uh, working on a crossword. Well, while you're here, why don't we have a little chat? If you do remember Dr. Gardner, then I'm sure you also remember his eight or nine, depending how you look at it, multiple intelligences. Now, before Gardner introduced his theory of multiple intelligences, educators were mostly concerned with their students excelling in two areas. Logical analyzation of problems or solutions, and the ability to understand and interpret language and writing. Gardner would eventually call these two intelligences logical mathematical and linguistic intelligence, respectively. These two theories were the theories that were most worked in schools before Gardner proposed his theory. Today we're going to focus on logical mathematical intelligence. Logical mathematical intelligence, in Gardner's words, entails the ability to detect patterns, reason deductively, and think logically. In other words, it is the intelligence concerning an individual's ability to analyze problems, recognize patterns, and solve complex equations. As the name implies, this type of intelligence is used mainly in areas like math or science which require more logic. For example, solving complex differentiation equations in calculus or calculating the rate of a cell's metabolic activity in biology would be examples of using your logical mathematical intelligence. Individuals with a strong logical mathematical intelligence tend to excel in areas that require multi-step thinking or solving complex equations, such as areas in science or mathematics. However, logical mathematical intelligence doesn't only apply to math and science. People with a strong logical mathematical intelligence tend to be really good at activities or games that require logical thinking, such as uh, chess or sudoku, crossword puzzles, or even jigsaw puzzles. In that case, people like Isaac Newton or Albert Einstein probably had strong logical mathematical intelligences because their careers required so many scientific calculations or logical reasoning and whatnot. Generally, people with careers related to chemistry, engineering, mathematics, physics, astronomy tend to have strong logical mathematical intelligences. Well, viewer, I hope you found that interesting. It's really neat stuff, actually. And if you're interested in learning about any of the other eight intelligences, just click here. Or here. Or here or here. <laughs> now, if you wouldn't mind, I have to train my own logical mathematical intelligence. Let's see. Seven letter word for noticeable, not easily hidden. Simple. Starts with an O. Oh. 